What's up guys, Connor here and welcome back to another YouTube video. Today, I'm actually going to be doing a house tour. I recently moved from my condo into a actual house house as you guys can see behind me. Um, I moved here about five or six months ago and I've kind of been getting a feel for the place before I gave a full tour. Also just trying to settle down, get everything complete, get my room finished, all that kind of stuff. Plus my life in my summer hasn't been too exciting recently so my vlogs would have been pretty boring anyways as usual. So um, yeah, let's get started. So you come down over there into the driveway and then from the driveway you walk to the kind of, I guess you could say front side yard. Now I'll explain why it's a front kind of side yard at the same time. So that's the front door, garage. My room is actually those two windows right there. Um, that's just kind of some lighting. That's my parents' room. My sister's room is on the other side of the house and then there's, you know, kitchen and all that stuff in there, obviously. So this is the yard. I have my rebounder here. Just a lot of grassy area so me and my friends can come out here and, you know, hang out and play around. I'm sorry if it's windy. There's a storm coming in if you guys can't see in the sky. Um, so it's not the best weather for this, but I just tell you to put something out. So the water is right here. In fact, I'll walk down there so you guys can see. Literally is how close it is. It's actually kind of scary. Uh, what scary because if there's a storm like a hurricane or even some minor flooding our house is gonna have some serious problems so guys really windy but oh my god the wind so our house that's our back porch and then the water starts there and it goes to right here and then this is the creek um yeah let's get at it right here so it's not all windy but i'm gonna take you guys inside okay again pardon the wind i'm sorry about that but it's again storm so this is our back porch this is my parents room i'm not gonna go inside there because you know it's parents you don't know what they're gonna do so this is their view uh the rest of the back porch you have a lot of people hanging out back here and there's a couple benches chairs grills down there this is our backyard those little canoes are like not canoes but kayaks over there is where it ends where the yard ends so we have all of this we have a little garden uh baby chair because you know we have a baby now. Uh, a little. We actually grow some vegetables here in these two gardens right here. So if we want to make like a salad, we can actually have a fresh salad instead of having to go to the store and buy some lettuce or whatever. And so that's kind of cool. So this this yard actually wraps around the house over there, which I'll show in a second inside, so it's not so windy. So from the back porch, you can either go into the sunroom, but that's doors locked. So we're gonna go into the living room. So this is the living room. I'm sorry that's any echoey. We have very tall ceilings, and there's really nothing to stop the sound from echoing. So, I said this is the living room. Front door is right there, so you walk in, take off your shoes, whatever, and it opens up. This is the only uh, bad part of the house so far that I've noticed is if someone's not expecting this, it's a pretty solid drop right here. I've already had two people fall because the entire floor is all one color. So, I mean, if you're sitting right here. It's kind of hard to tell if you're just kind of having a conversation with someone and you're just walking along and they can either just fall or trip or whatever. I'm expecting it obviously, but we have a TV right there, a bunch of shelves, a bunch of pictures. Let's see if I can find one of me. There we go. Mm, great. So you can even see a comparison in the reflection. Um, so this is our newborn, not ours, but it's my stepmom's son's kid. And so I'm now an uncle, that's so exciting. But this is a little mirror on the wall. And then you can either go from that side or the side that both be the same place. So this is like the kitchen and dining area right here. We were gonna put another TV here so it's a double sided. But the wiring would have been all messed up and we decided not to. We have a little two way fireplace in there. Eating area and then the sunroom, which is honestly my favorite room in the house. It's just so bright and open and nice in general. I mean, when, the, when it's actually a sunny day and it's not freaking storming outside, the sun will hit these little glittery ball things and the light will actually shine all over the room in like different colored beams. It's really cool. But yeah, we don't really know why this is here. Some random piece of art that we want to get rid of, but we're not going to. So that's the sunroom. I mean, come into the kitchen. It's where I spend most of my time making food and eating food, obviously. And then, you know, being a teenage boy and shoving my face with cereal. So we got a bathroom here, laundry room, and like storage. We have a garage. Obviously, no cars in it because everyone's at work. I'm home alone. But my dad has his work area out here. 
So all this tools and everything go there. Then this is just kind of some wall storage and then my lacrosse stuff and skateboards and kind of like kids recreational stuff goes there. I got some motocross sticks, bikes, big bike, coolers are out here. Um, and there is like, we have a vacuum system that goes through all the walls in the house and that's where that is. Um, so that's the garage, it's pretty, pretty nice. Nice finish the floors and all that. So now, I will take y'all upstairs. So actually, the cool part about the house too, is the upstairs actually has like a balcony. Cause my room is that, you guys can't see it, but that room. That's the guest room and then my sister's room is right behind this wall. So I'm gonna take you out there. And I realized that the case I have my, on my phone was an honor box, which locks out like the mic on the actual phone, which is right here-ish. And so while I was doing the upstairs part, I realized the audio was absolute shit until I have to record it again. So let's do it. So that's where we left off. I'm pretty sure I was talking about how you come from the kitchen and I'll say, I'll show you guys upstairs. So basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna record a video at night, like a little bit of a video, just showing just how different the house looks at night because it really does look completely different. These lights come on to light up your little staircase here. And once you come up the stairs, immediately to the right, you have the guest room. This is kind of just like where if I have a lot of friends over or we're having a lot of people over for an event, they can uh, stay in here, chill out, sleep. We have a little mini fridge and microwave for them, TV and Wi-Fi. Um, no one really comes in here often. I mean, my dad plays guitar in here every once in a while, but other than that, it's just kind of a ghost room and that's someone over. Someone is over. We have a closet here, and then my room is to the left. I'm sorry about the mess. I've either had friends over, or I just woke up, and it's kind of both right now. The friends just woke up. So, to prove to you guys, I actually did record this earlier. I was just about to start editing it. And that right there is a video that has shitty ass quality. So now I have to record this part again. I'm so happy. <laughs> so this is my room. I have a little closet here. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I, I used to keep all my hats here and then I moved them to behind my door, but they used to all be lined up and crawling there. And I started, I initially, when we first moved here, I was gonna hang up on my shirts like forever. And that's what I did for the first school year. And then I was like, you know, it's way too confusing. So I'm gonna start folding stuff, including like, you know, pajamas and pants and all that stuff um so that's my closet and then here it's kind of a cool room because we're gonna finish it it's not finished right now at all but we're gonna finish it and kind of make it into either a hangout room for me and my friends or an office for my dad and my stepmom so that's what it looks like right now we are directly above the garage just so you all know but yeah right now i'm just kind of using a storage and my sister's painting that for my dad it's cooler it looks pretty cool i keep one drum in here but uh yeah once we finish it and actually insulate it because right now it's hot as balls in here and at night it gets cold as shit and so we kind of have to make sure that that doesn't happen anymore so we're going to insulate it finish it put carpet in make it either an office or a hangout room it'd be pretty cool don't know what's going to happen but hopefully it's soon that could be my recording room who knows so it's my bathroom um nothing really too exciting just a regular bathroom it is a Jack and Jill bathroom though, so me and my sister or whoever else is staying in this room share a bathroom, kind of. There's our doors in between each little pathway. I'm not going to show my sister's room for privacy purposes, but that's basically the house. It's nothing too amazing. It's pretty chill. It's pretty cool. I will say I like it a lot better than the condo, which I get into later in the video. I get into like a little bit of how I miss the condo, but I like how social this is. I like how open you can be social from any part of the house. Even if you're upstairs, you just kind of chill on the balcony. Talk to people down there. You can yell into the kitchen. It does echo a lot, though, which is really annoying. But, uh, yeah, I'll send you to the outro. Peace out, guys. If you all like this house tour, leave a like, subscribe, turn on your post notifications, because me and AJ are going to start getting... I know we say every single video, we're going to get back into it. And I know it sounds like, oh, well, they always say it, but it's not. it never happens. No, I actually, I've actually had a really, really boring summer. I haven't really done anything. And it's just now starting to do stuff. I have two, two and a half-ish weeks of summer left. And so this past weekend, I went to a resort. I didn't record any there because I was just kind of chilling out and relaxing. I was only there for a night. But this, not this week, but next week, me and Liam, he was in a few videos back in my Fairfax video. And um, this is the first video I ever really edited he was in. And me and him and his family are going down to South Carolina 
or Hilton Head, if y'all know where that is, for a week. And then on Saturday, I think it is, we're watching the Total Eclipse, which would be cool. And I'm definitely going to get that on camera. It's going to be a fun trip. I'm going to record the entire week, get it on video, edit it. And so you guys can be expecting that very soon. I stubbed my toe like freaking hell in these rocks. We have like that rocky driveway material. It's really annoying. Mm, that hurt. So yeah, expect that. And then school starts up in about, like I said, two or three weeks. And so that's also going to slow down some videos. But when school starts, I'll also be able to have a lot more topics to talk about. Because I'll have school to talk about. And I'll have like events at school to talk about. Stuff like that. Sports. And so... It's going to be a lot more interesting, and I'm going to have a lot more to do and obviously make vlogs about. So hopefully you all enjoyed this video. hope you all enjoyed me being back. Me and AJ are both being back. I know AJ, he Snapchats me basically every day. Or we have a streak, obviously, on Snapchat, if you all know what that is. And every once in a while, we'll talk about video ideas, and obviously he's uploaded a few more than I have recently, which means, which is good to see because that means he's still doing it. That means I'll still do it. So I hope you all enjoyed. Leave a like. Comment down below any ideas or requests you guys have, and I'll see y'all later. Peace out.